This documentary focuses on design from the perspective of the GPDA program's students and lecturers. My name is Terry O'Neill. Um, I'm an ex-designer. I was at the CBC for 20 years, uh, 15 years in the documentary uh, department, uh, mostly with the nature of things. What do I do now? I'm a filmmaker and I teach part-time. Design for me is a verb. So it's going from the brief or the problem or the challenge to the thing. One size does not fit all. That's my thing with design. So, and I also want to see the personality or feel the personality of the designer. Now, whether that's, if you're an introverted designer, sure, do quiet introverted design. If you're a spaz and you're loud extrovert, your designs should reflect that. The biggest thing for, I could say to a designer, is you should be excited about the work that you're doing. If you're not excited about the work that you're doing, stop. Change roots. You should be like, like really into it. Find what you're excited about. Cause like, if you're excited about it, you're gonna do a good job. You're gonna spend more time. You know, you're gonna be invested. Um, I'm one of the faculty. So I'm a lecturer in user experience design and innovation. I've been there for about nine years now. I was actually the one starting the UX program in the master program and now teach predominantly undergrad. And um, I run a design company on the side. Uh, so I do strategy and UX and business development for companies on the side. What is design? Oh, that's a, that's a big fancy question. I'm not sure if I have a, a good answer for that. For me, design is problem solving. So design is different than art. Art is to make the world most beautiful and, and so on. But design is solving a problem with all the different tools we have. That could be furniture design, it could be systems design, or user experience design. Yeah, problem solving. Human-centered, right? So it's, it's about the people. I love being surrounded by my colleagues, the staff, the students. I love being surrounded by people that are passionate and I, I feel GPDA students come with an inherent passion. No matter what we do with you, you bring this to the table. The most important thing I gained from GPDA was the mentorship. I really felt that there was a lot of value in the mentorship with the faculty and the professors that we that we had. They really pushed us to be our best. And I think, you know, the most important thing that I took away from it was, you know, they really taught me what it meant to be a designer. And they really taught us that you need to put good into the world and not add to the clutter. You know, when you think about designing, you think about creating things, but it isn't necessarily about creating things. It's about adding purpose and adding value to people and the people that you are designing for. And I think that has really helped me and shaped the work that I do and the work that I wanna do. GBDA prepared me with the knowledge that the design industry is way too much for me. And instead of jumping to something like marketing, I jumped ship from design to administration, which is why I'm currently a receptionist right now. After reflection, UDA has prepared me pretty darn well, giving me so much knowledge, especially with like marketing and the knowledge of design, all of that stuff, because online marketing these days are really, really, really important. I think this program was what sort of gave me my career path. Before GBDA, I wasn't really aware of you know, UX design or product design as like a possible career or field. So I think GBDA, because you're introduced to a lot of like different skills, as I started working, I sort of realized, okay, like all these different things we learned, all that helped with my current job, because especially working at a startup, I have to sort of do a lot of different things instead of just product design. So um, having some baseline knowledge from GBA really helped me sort of take on a bunch of different roles that are needed and be flexible when it came to, you know, working.